Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Learn IT. Today's session, I will be talking about playbooks and process automation designer. So please watch my videos till the end for complete information. So let's proceed further on this one. So what is a playbook? A playbook is an UI through which agents or fulfillers interact with a business workflow in real time within workspace. Agents can use playbook to update records, upload attachment, complete tasks across multiple workflow activities. The playbook experience also provides fulfillers with visibility into cross business workflows and the task which is used to complete these workflows. All right. So this is playbook and how playbook looks like is like, so you can see this is a playbook playbook header is my INC process. And these are the stages for playbook and under each stages there are activity cards. So we will see this how we can create a playbook using process automation designer. First we will uh, tell you about how and how this playbook and process automation designer works. Alright, so let's proceed further and see what is process automation designer. So process automation designer enables process owners to author cross enterprise workflows and create a unified process. So we can create a process for particular thing like incident problem change, right? We can also use process automation designer to provide users with a simplified task oriented view of the process. So we can check the task oriented view of the process which is created under process automation designer. So now what are the benefits of process automation designer? We can connect multiple flows and actions into an end to end business workflows. We can use existing flow designer flows, subflows, actions to automate process of activities. We can organize activities in a digitized task board interface. We can define a consistent record life cycle from creation to completion. We can pass data between the activities and the stages in a business process. And we can as well as specify the conditions and the order in which those activities and stages will run. And through process automation designer, we can visualize and manage the activities and stages of the process. All right. So these are the process automation designer benefits. So now we will see what process automation designer contains. So it contains the name of the process, the triggers, the lanes and the activities. So these four are uh, Content is the major content for process automation designer for creation. So what is a process? Process is a representation of an business process for the organization. A process owner will be responsible for creating and managing the process. What is a trigger? Trigger is specifies when to start running your process. And what is lane? Lane is a group sequence of activities in a process in one lane you can create multiple activities through which we can specify logical group of activities a lane represent one stage in your overall business process and under each stages we have multiple activities what is an activity an activity defines the flow designer content that powers the process automation an activity can also specify the user facing experience that the process produces when it runs. All right. So this is process automation designer contents. So we can see what are the plugins required to be installed for playbook experience so that you can create a process under process automation designer and playbook experience. You can test the process, how it looks. So these are the plugins when you uh, install it with that, these all plugins will get installed. I will be proceeding with the demo in the next session. Till then, please provide your comment. If you have any questions, doubts or queries related to this session, 
For more information, please dis visit the description section under this video. Thanks for hearing me out. Stay tuned for more videos. Please do like, share and subscribe to my channel Learn IT. Thank you.